Well, uh, always a very, very good memory for me was the first time I did a class victory uh, in a GT class, and I think it was in 2000 at Sebring to win the 12 hours of Sebring was was very special and for me that was the very first endurance race I ever did in my life and then to come to Sebring and to win it it was special and that time we did it only with two drivers so I was completely done because I, I just didn't know what to expect you know my longest race was like 25 minutes in my career before that and then uh, I think finally the switch from because I've been a GT driver for a long time and I always wanted to, to drive the prototypes. Uh, but then finally when I was able to make the switch in 05 with Porsche and Roger Penske driving the RS Spider, I remember that, that uh, the first race we did at Laguna, the press and everybody gave us so much attention. And I mean, it's, you know, the godfather of racing, Roger Penske, and <laughs> suddenly you have him on the radio. It was a little bit scary, but also in the same time, it was very rewarding and, and we were very, or I was very proud of it that time. And now, uh, since 2010, I joined the MuscleMac uh, Pickett team and, and I just have a blast there. I, I just love the family, Craig Pickett and you know his sons. And I, when I have time or I have to kill some time in the US, I go hang out at their house and stuff. It's just a lovely family and, and I get along great with Klaus. He's a super, super nice guy, extremely quick. I mean, some of the best sports car drivers uh, raced with him or against him and they came to me and go holy shit this guy is quick <laughs> you know so uh no overall it's a, it's a very good atmosphere there and i enjoy every every race with them on the other hand as i said you know it's only it's only two races left with lmp1 cars in america and from race to race you get a little bit more sad and more sad because now you know it's only two left and then these cars are not going to be seen in the US for a while. But that's the way it is, you know, in life and racing, business, you name it. Uh, sometimes you have to make changes and uh, the, the future will show if these changes are good or, or not so good.